to the questions. None? The door to the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. Follow the signs. No stupid department. questions. Ready? The hotline should be in the communications department. Oh, here we go. Where did the hiss come from? I'm not sure. You said the hiss was here when you entered. Did you see anything like that outside before you came in? No. No, just inside. Mm. The source is internal then. See the old Oh, just inside this build just inside this building. Opening well. to the other places. Is what she meant. I don't inside the building but outside that room. But in the context, it's good news. The lockdown holds. The hiss escaping the building would be the end. Pretty shitty world out there if you ask me, but I wouldn't want the hiss to destroy it. I'm with you on that, Emily. Okay. So this doesn't do anything, right? Like I can I can keep asking these then. Mention the oldest house. What is it? This building, the bureau headquarters, the oldest house is a shifting place. Yeah, you've seen it. It transcends its physical limits. I've been to New York a few times. How didn't I notice this place? It's an attribute of the building. This is a place of power. The oldest house doesn't like attention. So unless you're purposely trying to find it, you don't, which is perfect for us. The work we do here is essential, but unstable. Right. The Bureau prefers not to be noticed. And we need strong walls to make sure nothing gets out. So without you, I never would have found the crime right. war. Okay. This trench guy. I keep hearing him in my head. Is he I thought ghost? we weren't telling her about that. Me? I doubt we're talking about a ghost in the traditional sense. I miss that. Echo, maybe. See, if he was killed by the service weapon, your gun, maybe it's his final thoughts recorded by the bullet in his brain, like a, a deep space probe sending back data. But that's just a hypothesis on my part. I need the gun to research it. <laughs> but you better hold on to that given the circumstances. Right. I think I will. Yeah. Can you tell me what an object of power is exactly? This is all... What? New. New to me. <laughs> Don't worry, I love going over the basics. So objects of power are mundane objects that house paranatural energies and have developed a link to the astral plane and can thus be controlled, which is what differentiates them from altered items. Which she has such a blank forces, stare. But are more volatile and cannot be bound in the peri-utilitarian sense. Got it? Did she memorize this? I don't say you got it. No, no. Thanks. You have no idea what she just said. You have no idea. So HRA stop you from becoming hiss. It seems that way. I mean, I hadn't even heard of an HRA until a few weeks ago when Dr. Darling started handing them out. Well, I began analyzing mine as soon as I got it. And each one seems to emit a powerful short range frequency way beyond anything I've ever seen. Doesn't the timing seem suspicious? I thought that too. Dr. Darling usually likes to unveil his latest breakthrough in big presentations. Right. With these, he was passed them out. His behavior makes me wonder what exactly he knew. Okay, that's all the answers. Thank you. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure Hellhound! What's going on, buddy? Just let me know. I miss you, man. You haven't been streaming lately. I miss watching your stuff. Uh, this is just currency, right? Uh, undefined reading. Like, I, I can't do anything with friggin' asset crap. Um, oh, a new guy. The only person you should fail is yourself. Thank you for that. That makes me feel a lot better. What? Oh. Oh. Oh, you can deconstruct them for... Uh, oh, cool. I didn't know that I picked another one up. Yeah, I've been busy. I was thinking about streaming either later or tomorrow. What are you thinking about streaming? What are you going to do? Have you... Oh, maquette's only PS5. I don't think you have a PS5. I was going to say it'd be cool if you did maquette. But... Can I... Can I do this? Oh. Oh, I have different outfits? Oh, I uh no we're here we don't have anywhere else to fast travel 
So enter the communications department to find the hotline. Where is the communications? Oh, that's up there. Okay. So I have to go up the stairs, which are over here. Probably going to play this again since I have it on PC and the Ultimate Edition on PS4. Uh, this is the first time I've ever touched this. So it's pretty, pretty good in 60 frames per second. I do enjoy it so far. Uh, that's a material. I don't know what to do with these materials yet, but I'm sure I'm going to learn. Oh, oh, oh. That's somebody down there that I can get to. Oh, it's a door. Open the door. There are so many. I've read everything. Like, there's so much to this game right now. Again, a welcome message. I, I can't get into that stuff yet. Whoa, whoa. Hello, buddy. Something happened to you. I like that it shows you, like, when you're about to walk, like, when you go into a room, it, like, highlights the thing that you need to pick up. It's, oh, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Can you shoot me through there? Yeah, you can. Oh, I got hurt. There. Uh, yes, yes. The option to turn off copyrighted music I have done. So I'm not too worried about the copyrighted music thing because even though I do the VODs, I download them and then I delete them. So... And then I edit them on the side and put them up on YouTube. And then YouTube lets me mute the specific sections of the copyright music. I did do it, but it's the only worry on Twitch about copyright music is if you keep the VOD on your site for a long time, on your, like, um, on the Twitch backend for a long time, published. So it's fine. Uh, ooh, health up. Hmm. Versus energy recovery. I'm going to keep the energy recovery. Uh, travel costs. Ooh. Now this depends on the, the currency. Visit the following Nevada accommodations. And $31 meal, $714. Gasoline, mini bar. I do wonder if a motel called the Ocean View is going to be found in a landlocked state. But hey, I guess I'm not paid to think, right? And for the record, I again request that you give us the budget to get two rooms each night. Agent Rowley and myself are very tired of sleeping in the same room. Be on the road. The boys in research said performing rituals may help identify any places of power. Drinking those little whiskeys is my ritual. That's funny. Uh, there's a couple songs. One of them is copyrighted written if you find it. The other I'm assuming isn't because I had that option on and the song still played. Oh, that's weird. Yeah, not a big deal. I'm not, I'm also not an affiliate or a partner, so they're probably not gonna do anything. Guessing, oh, oh, hello. Oh, fuck. Is that it? Nope. Nope. That sounded like there's another one. That sounded like that's another one, too. Dead letters. Okay, you know what? I kind of want to see what that was up there first. So let me do that. What the heck was this? Oh my god. I just literally lost... A shitload of my health there. 
That sucks. Ooh, weapon mod. I don't have any weapon mods yet. Hello. Exclusive to shatter. Oh. Oh, I can't use it. What does exclusive to shatter mean? Oh! Oh. Oh. Yep. Means on only that form can use the I don't even know what forms are right now. But that's that's new to me. It'll make sense later, okay. Yeah, I have no idea what forms are. Other than like whatever this is. I don't use I don't use this though. Oh you can break terrain like that? Holy crap. Ah What's this? All back to normal, baby. So that's a that's a travel or like a a fast travel point. Friends can still to gain access to fast travel sites throughout the oldest house. Okay, so this is called the oldest house. That's what it's called. Oh, I can go in these doors now. Uh, the Hiss Resonance Field is a physical impediment that is difficult to define. Hiss barriers repeat as ways to impede escape or access by Bureau personnel. Two methods have been discovered for lowering them. Destroy the multiple concentrated resonance sources found in the vicinity. Destroy the Hiss entities in the area. The resonance fields seem to require support for their size and density from other non-connected sources of Hiss Resonance. Without the ability to draw from these sources, the barrier will fall. Does an inactive structure made of his resonance qualify as a conscious being? Does the distinction make any difference when, consider, when considering the hiss? What does the very act of building walls to prevent our movement tell us about the hiss? To what degree is it watching and planning? Okay. Oh, wait. Did I not? Did I miss one? Oh, yes, I did. Uh, the Bureau Book Bunch will convene at the usual spot. Everyone should get their reviews to me by Monday. Okay, so that's just like random stuff that goes on in the office that's funny this game reminded me so much of the shows warehouse 13 and the lost room i have no idea what those are rush hold kids all right There's another one. Those videos freaked you out. So what's been going on, Hellhound? What's uh anything new and exciting with you? Oh god, don't even don't even look. Uh dead letters. I I am being contacted by the past presidents of the United States of America. They appear as spirit guides giving me their wisdom. John Adams keeps saying I need to fix America, but I can't really understand him. They ha all have a lot of opinions. People tell me I'm imagining it, but Theodore Roosevelt showed me how to fix my lawnmower, and I don't know a thing about lawnmowers. I have great dead men telling me about the past and the present. If you'd like to use my abilities to help run the government, please let me know. I know the White House could use me. Yours and Ernest James Bartholomew. Uh, just keeping things around the house going, because you live with your um, 
your grandma, I believe you said, and you've been living with her for a while. Yeah, so that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Nothing, nothing. Uh, nothing. Oh, there's something on the floor here. Something on the floor. Thank you. This is another dead letter. Oh, dead, dead letter approval. I'd like to thank you for approving my request for the Dead Letters Archive, cataloging the Bureau's collection of delinquent uh, mail will provide an extremely handy database that research teams can use to research to search for any connections or related topics found among the letters. Aside from the more functional purposes, the archive will allow us to preserve these windows into authentic human encounters with the uh, paranatural world. Letters came to us from various places and times gathered by the postal services as undeliverable. The Bureau is the perfect home for them. I realize not all letters contain accounts of genuine paranatural events, but even the erroneous ones, erroneous, sorry, ones allow us insight into how the unknown is perceived by real people. Of course, I will first compile a system to allow us to analyze the letters for any information or suspected connections to AWEs and other altered materials. So thank you again. Can't wait to delve into my dead letters. Interesting. Uh, another health boost. Another holy. Singing fish. I called the police, but they never come. They but they never come to my house. I got a problem, and you got to send folk to fix it. I got my wife one of them singing fish on the walls. It's not a real fish. It sings when you hit a button, but it's got the devil in it. It flies around at night and sings devil songs. Say lots of cuss words. The devil got in my house because of the fish, and you got to come handle it. My wife is real upset. Upset. When can you come? Sincerely, Dwayne Barr. Okay. Um, let's go up and around. This is where I was last time. Um, I already went into these. Oh, I didn't go into these. So this is another one. Oh, you live with both your grandparents. I thought you just lived with one grandparent. A whopping 80 kilobytes. <laughs> Stolen by our friends at the CIA. The disc held the launch codes to Soviet nukes. Is that like a B floppy disk? I think that is. Uh, this is not the disk, of course, but one exactly like it. A perfect fusion of concepts vibrating in the Cold War era collective unconscious. A receptacle. It is a receptacle for dangerous energies to hone in. Both of them, but they're your grandma's the one you're helping out. Okay, that makes sense. Makes sense, man. You're you're a good man. Like that's that's a lot of work. A lot of work, man. Uh, I lost my job yesterday. Hellhound. That's that's news. Um, I'm okay. It's uh, it is what it is. I'm I'm on the job hunt again. So, um, yeah. One day, one day I will write a book about my life. Um, it won't be a very exciting book, but one day I'll write a book. Okay, let's go. Let's go communications. On the right track. Um, let's go in here first. One day there's going to be something in these bathrooms. One day. Um. You'd buy that book, yeah. My uh, my life has been um, a roller coaster. Ooh, that looks like something I can unlock eventually. Um, undefined reading. Oh, excuse me. Oh, that's that's once again another asset. Yeah. So the I'm gonna be able to get into those eventually. Yeah, I'm gonna to have to. I guarantee I have to be a, another form, as you were saying. Um, let's keep going. Oh, oh, oh. What's that? Oh. Uh, not gonna go in there. What are these safe houses? A 
another undefined reading. Um, ooh, so I don't usually read a lot of sci-fi, but as far as space operas go, this was all right. The title, unless you could refer to a bunch of things in the book, I guess, but I thought it was a little vague and stupid. The way the characters kept throwing it around almost like a catchphrase got real annoying real fast. The best part of the story was the space battles. I sided with the fixers, obviously, because they had the coolest tech and their motives made the most sense to me. Honestly, if you had to choose between some hoity-toity flowers and guns, space hippies, or a badass bunch of warriors who were on devouring planets like cheap sushi on a Sunday, I knew who I'm picking. That scene where they invaded city planet and convert the entire population using these brain worms, that space dog fight between these two ace pilots, sign me, sign me the F up. What kind of ru... What kind of ruined the whole thing for me was when my favorite character got killed not even halfway through the story by getting a battery cylinder launched into his face by a gravitational anomaly. His death didn't feel necessary at all. Oh. Oh. Uh, just loot stuff is usually in them. Okay, cool. So they are still worth going in, though. Okay, let's go, uh, let's go in here. Object of Oh, how do I crouch? How do I crouch? Okay, there we go. Oh, oh, that hurt. How do I... Reach the object of power to cleanse it. Well, I'm not going to be able to get in here, so that was only to do that. Oh, rate of fire boost. Um, health recovery per element pickup. Wait. Wait, wait. Can I... Ooh, rate of fire boost. Yay, I was able to add one. Hold on. Oh, no, never mind. Uh, spoiler, what if I wanted to read that book? Did it say what book that was? Because that sounds super familiar. Like, that wasn't called Penny. Or, no, wait, wait. What was... Oh, Four Penny. Fixers? Why does Fixers sound like Firefly or Serenity? I'm going to go up here. Maybe it's a reference to Firefly? Yeah, maybe. Is there anything back here? So how do I... Reach the object of power to cleanse it. There we go. It's a B floppy disk! Oh, the floppy disk nuke can be bound to gain launch telekinesis. Oh. It's harder to hear you when I'm here. Boards in charge here. Their pyramids in the bureau seal. Are they really the ones pulling the strings? I'm not their director. I'm no one's director. Uh, R1. R1. Oh, shit. That's pretty crazy. This world's cool. Oh, don't fall.
If you want to know something crazy and you never would have known it, I would love it. Throw it at me. What am, what am I going to learn? That I had this ability the whole time and I could have used it the whole time? Oops. Come on. The guy you saw get bashed in the hallway was the same who wrote the letter about the book we were just talking about. Oh, how do you know that? I was looking up about what story they were talking about and it mentions that. Oh, I would have never known that. Never known that. Okay, I'm done with you. Get out of here. Because he died the same way the character did that he didn't like. Oh, through a... That's so true! Oh, that's hilarious. A gas canister. That's so interesting. That's a really cool thing to learn. There you are. You were gone. Cut off. I got it. Just like you wanted, right? This will help me. The hell is that thing? Oh, against shields. Oh. Where's this? Where's this last one? There's someone here. Still. I swear there was someone else here. Oh, you're up there. Right here. I don't even have, I can't even get into there. Hey, Psychroat, welcome. Oh, you know who else I have to do that to? Slash, the hell, hound, gang, anyone. Yeah, yeah. Welcome to the VIP club, hellhound. Hope you enjoy your stay. Oh, God. No, thank you. Whatever that means. So now I can throw a bunch of shit. Said that the hotline can be reached through the mail room. Oh. So can I just I can just move this stuff now, right? I'm thanking him because he is a loyal Fred Rockian slash Rocklet slash buddy pal guy. Uh, he's thanking me because I gave him VIP status. Being my VIP means that he can post links to stuff without getting in trouble. Obviously. 
I thought I I thought there was something in the mail room. I thought that was the whole point of me coming to the mail. It was like you can enter it through the mail room. Guess not. Oh, maybe it's this mail room. Oh, here it is. Nope, that's not it. Oh, more stuff. Uh, ooh, his demolition. Girl only allows certain highly trained individuals to handle volatile materials and weaponry. Our demo demolition experts are instructed in the use of explosives and dimensions with distinct physical laws, making them important assets for engineering work as well as combat situations. His demolition experts are the only observed his variations to wield the specially built rocket propelled grenade that is designed to identify and track entities once fired making them a threat whose termination should be prioritized in combat scenarios. I find it remarkable that the Hiss restrict usage of this weapon to the Bureau personnel who train specifically for its use. What does this tell us about its behavior? Can it not pass along new information to corrupted entities? Still too unknown. Too many unknown. This is a Hiss Ranger. Rangers are Bureau's well-trained and well-armed ex expedient expeditionaries forces. Their Hiss corrupted counterparts are equally formidable. Prior to corrupt... Rangers were trained to use a variety of weapons in order to face any threat found during a W response or threshold exploration, including submachine guns, assault rifles, and automatic shotguns. His rangers utilize these weapons as well as the advanced tactics taught by Bureau instructors. Some are additionally outfitted with Bureau-made body armor. His rangers have no observed paranatural abilities beyond some being protected by the shielding of dense Hiss residents capable of stopping bullets. Considering the advanced training the Hiss rangers are capable of, applying to their situation is to is it feasibly to consider the human mind still remains intact to some degree? Or is the Hiss able to tap into this combat training and utilize it for their observation as required? I thought this said that I had two. What? Oh. I I had an unread. Uh, national news sites have begun publishing the story of the polar bear attack in the Alaskan town. You all know I don't like to boast, but claiming that the family was killed by migrating polar bears desperate for food because their ecosystem is being ruined by global warming was a stroke of genius. Using current ecological concerns makes the public much, much less likely to blank. Another AW behind us and the public is none the wiser. Well done, everyone. It was a strong campaign and perfectly executed. This doesn't mean we can stop monitoring blank, blank, and blank. And for any off-message opinions, but it's looking like we're in the clear. Okay. So, yeah. This, okay. Can I, should I go upstairs? Or should I stay down? There's so many places to go. There's also like so much stuff to pick up now. What is this? Maybe there's a key. Oh. This must open the door. The guy just like flipped. And this is gonna okay here we go here's the control point for fast travel i love how open the game feels even though the world is small it's it's a little nuts right now um these bathrooms are weird though like i don't understand going into the bathrooms. I can never collect anything in any of them. Uh, I guess we'll just go upstairs.
You definitely move at a slower pace in this kind of world, too. Oh, there we go. You're listening to America Overnight. Oh. This is defined the airways for more than 29 years. Why did I need two clearance, one key cards? Oh, oh. Oh, I don't like it. Nope, don't like it. Uh, I don't like this either. So, we're gonna take this first. Uh, multimedia I already got. Uh, lockdown distinctions. Pay attention, Alberto, this is the last time I'm explaining this. Internal lockdowns are manually triggered events that lock one or all of the sectors by restricting the use of the sector elevator, effectively locking staff in their sector until the emergency is handled. They can only be lifted via the directorial override maintenance once the director is satisfied that the situation is under control. External lockdowns are a bigger deal. Nothing in or out of the whole building. It's only triggered by a code red containment breach based on some complicated system that security and research slap together. It can only be lifted once and the threat has been neutralized. Oh, once. Oh, so <laughs> it can only be lifted once. The threat has been neutralized and a high clearance individual gives the system an all clear. Ross is not the same as the directorial override, so stop saying so in documentation. I know it's confusing as hell. I've told Darling a hundred times to change it, but they're adamant it stays the same. It stays the way it is. Honestly, I don't think they even know how to change it at this point. Let's just make sure our staff understands how this mess all works. Okay. Get it. Um, I think I brought people out in this. So I'm going to go back here. It's because, because two ones make it two. Thanks. Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Uh, see ya, see ya, see ya. Oh, that hurts. Oh, I need to throw something at you. Never mind. That's what I need to do. Why I have this? Um, there. A reason, buddy. Okay, so I got a bunch of stuff there. Um, I don't have the shatter thing still, so that's that's still a little confusing to me. Uh, ammo cost per shot. Oh, I like my rate of fire being up more. That's gonna help me a lot more. There was a data breach last month. Our on-site server experienced an intrusion by unauthorized users. After a thorough investigation, it was confirmed that the user only accessed a video file, which contained portions of various Dr. Darling presentations. Investigators were able to track the users through their IP addresses. These individuals are in breach. Okay. Go to my loadouts page. Um, okay. Unlock by upgrading. Like, I can break these down. I know that. And they will give me money. I don't know how to upgrade anything. Do you see where it says grip? Uh, yep. Oh, that's my... Okay, that's going to be the type of weapon. Oh, the type of grip. You can unlock more forms. Okay, okay. Cool, cool. Thank you. Um, Is there anything else in here? Oh, this right Ooh, a rate of fire boost. Is that a better rate of fire? That's a lower rate of fire. Sucks. Yeah, I only have the one. 
Um, so is that is that everything in here? Yeah. I only came in here so that I could get that secret over there. It seems. Okay. All done. Go in here now. What is this? Oh my god, it's hurting. Oh my god, it's hurting. I'm gonna die now, once I go in there. I'm guessing I have to go there really fast? Um, I need to collect some health. Yeah. That's for later on? Okay. okay. I will not go there. And I can't go anywhere else, right? No. Okay, I'm not gonna go there. Let's get out of here. Um, proceed through the communications department. Uh, I'm going to keep going. Not this way. I'm in the communications department, though. Oh, oh, shit. I missed the I missed the door that was over here. Oh, but I can't go through it. Oh, uh, that sucks. Okay, so there's got to be another door I missed. Oh, shit. Get it. Oh. Oh, no, I already did that. I already did that. Okay, so don't, don't go in there. Don't die. That's a that's a key point number one. Whoa. Hello. Uh, I will take you. Oh, that's not good. Oh my god. Oh my god. You piece of crap. Ow. I just got hit. See ya. See ya. Yeah. Oh, I'll read that later. I'll read it later. Oh, shit. Hold on. Where are you? Throw that. Thank you. Where is this person? Where are you? Oh, you're right there. Yeah. I'll run this way. Guy is annoying. There's got to be more health here. There. Where is this person? Stay away from me. Thank you. Woo. 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 
See ya! This game in a good forces you to, wait, this game is this game in a good forces you to mix your gun combat and your abilities to play. Right. Oh, in a good way it forces you to mix your I get what you're saying. I get what you're saying. Hey everyone, thanks for watching this video. I appreciate the support. If you like the content, consider subscribing to the channel so you can catch any future content that gets released. Also, you can catch me live on twitch.tv slash fredrock as I stream a variety of games over there. All other ways to support me are down in the description below, so feel free to click on any of those links. Thanks again.